So hey everybody, I thought I would just make this quick video, at least in my mind, it's going to be quick. I've had a rough day. As we last left me, hold on, I got to switch hands, I can't. Um, oh, and I'll tell you why in a minute why it was rough. So the last video I put up, I was going to my doctor's office, um, got my blood work up, and urinalysis and blood pressure. Um, no problem. I mean, you know, in, out, in 10 minutes, whatever. But uh, I think I had told you at some point that I was going to be put on a different depression, anxiety medication, and I was going to start it. Um, when I left the doctor's office. Seriously? It's not that hot. Okay, it's all right. Come on. I turned the air conditioner. There's my new air conditioner for inquiring minds. Um, works good. It's just super loud. So if we want to be cool, we have to keep the TV up to like, you know, volume 30 or something. Anyways. So... She put me on so uncomfortable. Again, I'll tell you why. Um, Lexapro. Five freaking milligrams. Like the lowest. They only make ten. So I had to cut it in half. I kid you not. I got home within, I don't know, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Immediately I felt the effect of it. Sleepy. Headache. Just not myself. And I hate this feeling. Um, now, last night, this morning, whatever you want to call it, I've been up since 3.30. So I don't know if this is in conjunction with being sleep deprived that it hit me really hard. Or if it's the same old story as Prozac, as Zoloft, as something else I tried, and now the Lexapro. I don't understand what is the deal with the side effect of being sleepy and just feeling, and it also sort of took away my appetite. I mean, it's like I didn't even really want lunch. I really didn't even want dinner. I sort of had to force myself. Um, I fasted until after my doctor's appointment. I did end up going to Starbucks because I forgot I had $4 left on my Starbucks card. I had a wonderful decaf, non-fat, you know, sugar-free, not sugar-free, just non-fat pumpkin spice latte, and two pieces of gluten-free toast on the way home, which I showed you. So I was, you know, I was hungry. I wasn't that hungry, but I was like... Well, it, this tastes really good. So, as everybody knows, I do take pain medication, a narcotic. And I'm not going to say it. I may have said it in the past, but I'm not going to say it now. Um, back, neck, wrist, shoulder, whatever you pick a pick a body part. Um, generally, it is for my bad wrist. Um, I was afraid to take it. I was literally scared to death to take it. I mean, the pharmacist, oh, no problem. You might, you know, it might just increase um, the, um, you're really hot, huh? Are you hot, baby? I got to get off of here fast and get her cooled down. Um, so I, I just want to ask you guys, I know everybody responds differently to medication, but if anybody out there is on some depression or anxiety medication, please comment below and let me know your experience with it. I mean, I'm done. I'm, I'm pretty much done because I can't risk feeling this way again tomorrow. I mean, I was, I was scared to drive. I just, I, all my energy was just completely zapped. I did nothing. And this is the first day in a long, long, long time that I did nothing. I went 
nowhere. I bought nothing. Um, and I felt like it was a waste of a day. So if there's anything that works for you, please give me your experiences um, in the comments below. Or you can email me. Um, I don't know how to get a message on YouTube. I can't do it on mobile unless I convert into the, you know, into internet and desktop site. And I still can't find stuff. Um, all right, baby, I'm going to, I'm going to get off. I'm going to, I'm always going to get off and turn the air back on. Um, like I said, or email me, Lynn, L-Y-N-N-E, obviously, 94010 at gmail.com. Um, if you don't feel comfortable commenting below, which I completely understand. So, um, I just, I don't know how to retrieve YouTube messages. I, I would have to look into it and I'm really not in the mood for it. Um, but I mean, being without pain medication all day long and your head banging and every body part and your joints are all screwed up. Um, and I'm alone. So, you know, and I'm not where I used to live, where if something would go wrong, I could go knocking on a neighbor's door or something. Who am I going to knock here? You know, am I going to hand the phone to Kamiley to call somebody to call who I don't know, but, um, it's really been a bad day. So like I said, email me um, with your experiences with any medication um, that you could recommend that you've had good experiences with. Um, I just, I don't understand why every single pill I've tried, the side effect is sleepiness, drowsiness, and not feeling like yourself. I, I just don't, I don't understand. Maybe I'm just too sensitive to maybe all of these pills that I've been taking have a certain ingredient in them. I don't know. I'm not going to sit there and research everything, but all I know is I'm not going to feel this way tomorrow and waste a day. Um, and then I know these pills don't kick in for about three to four weeks. I just can't do it. So thanks in advance. And um, I will talk to you, I guess, tomorrow. Bye.